Welcome, I'm Dr. Craig Weinston, and I'm excited to bring to you our newest program on transformational living. These programs are designed to give you bite-sized pieces of longer programs that we've presented that instruct people on how to live more healthful ways of living. I hope that you enjoy the program. Thank you for joining us. So this is water mixable oil paint. It's very easy to wash even though it's oil, so you don't have to use anything toxic like turpentine. Yeah. And what I do is put some paint but not too much on the board. So you can get playful with color, but it's not about trying to do a painting on the board. It's just it's basically you want to roll some color out that you like. A lot of people really enjoy the rolling part. You can think of it as clearing your mind in between drawings, emptying out. And you put the paper down, and all you do is move your fingertips on the board, and I'm going to start really simple. And everywhere you touch, the lines form. And notice how I'm touching with um, fingertips, fingernails, whole hand. So the hand is really the tool of expression. So let's just see what it looks like. Oh, oh my. Maybe uh, I have a feeling of like, oh, I just don't even want to think. So I take my head and I cover it over. You just go from one moment to the other to the other. and. That's all you ever have to do. So even if you're feeling something difficult or painful or blank, it's just part of the larger process. That's an interesting expression there. Something in me was searching for something more natural. And when I do my whole slide pro program, I show some of the back influences around that search. But on my last day of school, I was in the print shop, and I was... Um, helping a friend clean up. They ink rolled out on pieces of glass. So I put a paper towel down on the piece of glass. Let's pretend that's a paper towel. And right before I started wiping, in that instant, I decided to play instead. And I moved my fingertips and back, just like that. And I picked up the paper towel. And I was blown open that all I did was in an instant move my fingertips and I was feeling, I was trying to find a more natural way to draw. I was frustrated with something felt unnatural in art. Here was this fingertips creating images, and I started laughing hysterically. I started by going back completely to pure childhood play, and that's how I made that pure energetic connection. So I think, be a first grader, pick the colors you like. Pick colors that feel like you're, like you're feeling, and as it dries out, you can move to different colors, you can mix a couple on the board. If you get into more, you know, advanced touch drawing, you know, you can have um, several different boards with different colors on it, move your drawing from one board to another. So I share, you know, what variations you can move into. But in the beginning, I encourage people to be simple and not try and make a painting on the board. But just, yeah, more like a gut feeling about the color. It becomes, it's an opportunity to really develop your own like let your soul have a voice in images and it's very personal language.